you're watching 120 seconds. Help me cause I'm falling and I just can't see. I started playing guitar when I was 14 and then I started playing coffee shops around Detroit when I was 15 and just knew I really wanted to pursue it. So I had one opportunity and that was a friend living in Los Angeles and I just packed my bags right after I graduated high school. Everyone was saying, what are you doing playing with their heart? I waited tables and I was a cake decorator and I would come home and write songs at night. So I was like 19 I think and I've been in LA a little while and I started singing demos. Somehow I ended up meeting Warren G. So I ended up singing a hook on his record. That bought me a little bit of time and then I went to London actually for a little while and came back and got signed shortly thereafter. Sometimes I can't let go Sometimes I move show has sort of evolved, I guess. It used to be a little more singer-songwriter, a little more intimate, a little more serious. I just learned to just enjoy myself on stage. Between songs, I tell a lot of jokes and get the crowd laughing and just sort of have a good time so that it's not just a musical experience, but it's an all-around good night out. Thank you so much. I made my record at Ironworks, which is owned by Kiefer Sutherland and Jude Cole. And making a record was really fun. All the musicians gathered in a big room and we played every song live and then we went out all the time and we had drinks and rolled around Los Angeles. It was really a fun couple of months. My music is sort of a really weird hybrid. It's acoustic singer-songwriter meets kind of neo-soul meets sort of jazz. I don't know, it's all kind of thrown together, but it works. I just want to get out there and play and reach people and have a good time.